came out it's from Wales Interactive and also Good Gear Media currently priced at $8.99 which in the store we're gonna leave a link in the description so five dates is about a guy called Finney he's joined a dating app because he's in lockdown um, so he wants to experience different things and also get to meet people while we're going through this COVID-19 pandemic so it is set in real time you know, what we're experiencing now um, so the idea is you join this dating app you pick a selection of five dates and you take three of them I'm just gonna erase that and you'll go on a series of dates so the first first date with three of the girls um, and then you'll progress to a second date with two of them and then you'll get your third to final date with one of them so this is us with Vinay just setting up our profile so we we'll make a profile picture we'll just go for traveling one we can work in healthcare perhaps interests um travel technology and sports to keep them fit star sign we can pick anything at all we'll just go with the first one capricorn so that's our profile set up Callum is Vinny's best friend oh. it's his wingman <sighs> have you actually just woken up <sighs> yeah what's the issue man well nothing I just never understood how you can sleep until lunchtime lunchtime <laughs> Ah oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, furlough life has got my body clock battered, bruv. Fair play for keeping a routine in lockdown, man. Fair play. Well, key workers don't really have a choice. It's been it's been really, really intense to be honest. I can imagine, man. Honestly, you have been putting in a shift, mate. My hero. Relax. Honestly, mate, I'm swooning. I think I've got a semi right now. Okay. <laughs> anyway, listen, listen, listen. Before I need, I need to tell you something. I have, I'd say, just a little bit of a surprise for you. Oh, go on then. I joined a dating app. No way. <laughs> hey, this is huge, bro. Listen, I was all alone in my <laughs> flat with, <laughs> all alone in the flat with nothing else to do, and I just thought, why not? You know what? I'm hearing that digital dating is popping off during lockdown, you know? Have you got any video dates yet? No, I literally just joined. Okay, hey, Vin, hey, Vin, seriously, yeah? No joke. Your profile needs to be on point, yeah? And then when you're looking at these girls' profiles, <laughs> there's a few things you need to watch out for. You need to look at the angles that they're using to take the pictures and that, yeah? But deceive you. Callum, I have, I have talked to girls before. I do understand what you're doing. I have talked to girls before. Okay. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, hold on. I just got a notification. Uh, no way. It looks like I've got beginner's luck. Oh, you sexy bastard, bruv. Yes, yes. <laughs> I've got some matches. All right, man, let me know how it goes, bro. Peace. All right, cool, man. Bye-bye. So what's happened now is he's got his notification. He's got match with 5% potential suitors. Um, he has to make a choice. Just press the A button for that. So the first one is Maya. She's 22. She's into um, art and culture, partying and music. She works in education. Then we've got Grace, 27. She likes travel, food, drink, music. Other industries, I'm not quite sure what she does. She maybe, she maybe doesn't work at the moment. Got Saffron, 24. She's creative. Well, she could be various things, spirituality, art and culture, charity. Shayna, she's in, she's in healthcare as well. Technology, food, drink, charity. And Paige, 25, and she's into sports, fitness and travel. So we need to pick three of these. So you can pick any you want. There's 10 possible outcomes, 10 possible endings. And there was over seven hours of FMV video footage captured for this game. If you're a fan of Wales Interactive Games, you know what they're about. They're about the interactive movies that you just play out. A couple of choices here and there. And your decisions affect the outcome. We really, we do really like the games that uh, Wales Interactive put out. So we're going to pick...
top, middle, bottom, perhaps? May uh, No, I think we'll we'll change it up. We'll go for them three. So they've all accepted a date. Oh, this guy's looking pain, bro. I've got three video dates scheduled back to back. Okay, show off. No, 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 not really. I've, I've never been on a digital date before. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, just treat it like a real life date, I guess. You know, people seem to be really enjoying them as well. Okay, and is this a good setup? I've got this right. Uh, you know what? I don't think you should have the bed in the back like that, man. It sends out the wrong message. Okay, I'm definitely moving into the living room. Okay. Oh, trying to look like a slut. Ah. Uh, Ugh, Vinny. All my intention. Vinny, we've spoken about this. It's, it's, it's just wrong, man. It's wrong. <laughs> now, you want to find a spot where the natural light is hitting your face, kind of like it's hitting mine and making me look so goddamn beautiful. And also, what you want is eye level. Set the camera to eye level, bro. Not low angle or high angle. They are not flattering. Okay, I think this is a good spot. Uh, let's get that fireplace yeah. looking nice in the back. Okay, maybe we have a couple more things. I really am so nice. Oh yeah, okay, I've got like, uh, a trophy from when I was a kid. Dead. Ah, yeah, show her that you're a winner. Yeah, and culture, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, I think we're, we're ready. Oh, should I drink? It is your call entirely, mate. Oh, the worst thing, though, is if uh, you're so drinking... The first choice, we can grab some beer or none. We'll just keep... I'm so nervous. Um, I'm going to go sober. I'm not going to drink. Brave man. Brave man. Okay, I think... Um, you're set, man. Listen, you are going to smash this date, yeah? And you jump on all confident like, and you say her first name straight away. Straight away. Straight in. Smiling. Show them all your teeth. Okay. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Show no. them all the teeth. Oh, my God. I think the first one's about to Which start. One hey, start. go well, lad. Okay. All right, cool. Listen, I'll, uh, I'll debrief you after. I'll let you know how it goes. Peace, boy. All right, peace. I'm going to click on this. Okay, bye. Cool. So this is his first date. Mm -hmm. So this is with Maya. Maya. Um, just press the A button to join. Just a very quick recap, this is a video dating app. Uh, Hello! Hi! Sorry, I needed to be... <laughs> Hi! No, I'm okay, that, I can't argue with that then, that's fine, that's, that's what you need to do. Okay, cheers, how are you, Vinny? I'm, I'm good, thank you very much. I, I think I can slightly detect an accent. Am I correct? You're so, very observant, yeah. yeah, yeah. Where do you think I'm from? I've heard, I've actually heard a few footballers interviewed that sound a little Good bit choice, like you. you. Um, yeah, footballers Spanish? from my country are very good in the world, I will say, personally. <laughs> that has to be a Spanish accent, surely. Muy bien, very yes? good, yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm very impressed, how do you know? I think I just, I don't know, probably just a good ear for these kind of things. Yeah, uh, come we'll on, guess, I, I know. It was a lucky guess, right? Or not do it. I would love to tell you that I'm really knowledgeable and cultured and everything, but I just got lucky this time. But I did fancy my chances, so... That's a good thing. Lady Locke is your friend. Honesty as well. Another really good thing, so... And hopefully Lady Locke works out in this scenario too. Well, so we'll, uh... we'll see, won't we? <laughs> so, um, how's lockdown been treating you? Another lockdown question? So boring. Okay, no, no, we, we, we don't have to talk about it if you... If I'm kidding. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, I've been keeping really busy. I'm a language teaching assistant, so... Oh, wow, nice. Uh, what languages? Spanish, obviously. Yes, Spanish, and then Italian and French as well. So I've been doing online classes with my students, and then some private tuition, too. So it's my side hustle. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. That's pretty cool. Mm. The good thing about languages is no matter how hungover you are, you never forget them. <laughs> <laughs>
fair, that's fair. And I, I noticed that um, there was some other interest in your profile. Yeah, which ones in particular? Um, okay, they all grabbed my attention immediately. But if I had to pick one thing about the amazing you things about you, I would pick choice. Sure, right. yes. I get that's it, exactly I get what it. I meant. <laughs> okay, it's it's got to be music, right? Oh, no, me, oh. <laughs> music. Music is everything in my life. I'm always listening to something. Nice. Can I send you a song? Oh, yeah, go. Yeah? Okay, I think I can send them through the app. Hang on. Yeah, cool. If Yeah, you send it your own and I'll just click it on mine. Okay. 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 Let me know when it's sent. Yeah. Okay, cool. This, this is my favorite song at the moment. Okay, cool. I just think it's so like fun. It like it makes me think of beach parties, you know? What do you think? Uh, we'll just see if I like it. <laughs> this is your favorite, yeah? <laughs> yeah, no, no, listen, I'd be on the beach dancing with you. Seriously, I, this is cool. I like this. Yay! Oh, great. Mojitos on you, no? On me? <laughs> So I have to buy the drinks, yeah? Yeah, I think so. Okay, no, no, that's I a fair play so. for showing me some yeah. good music. This is kind of like a little dancing day. I like it. This is a good song. You great taste, Vinny. You great taste. <laughs> this is great. Okay, tell me, Vinny, what do you like? Ooh, okay, what have I been listening to recently? <sighs> if I had to, um, to name one genre... Um, we'll put rock. It'd probably be... <laughs> we'll up a bit. You must know. I wonder if you listen to this. Rock music. Rock music. Yeah. Okay. Rock, is that... Uh, no, I don't. It's not my kind of music, but. Okay, I guarantee you that there'll be some stuff you'll like. I've tried it. I have tried it. I just like it, but you do you, man. You do you. Fair enough. <clears throat> Sorry, I get a bit aggressive when I'm passionate about something. Passionate. What? Is. Passionate, you said passionate. Oh, shit. <laughs> Mierda. Sorry, it's, it's the wine. You can always correct me when my English is bad, please. No, please. no, no, listen, I promise you it's perfect. It's better than mine. Okay, well, it's definitely not, is it? But I have a question for you, Vinny. Okay, go on. I'm all is. Would you call yourself introverted or extroverted? Oh, I said that right, yeah? Oh, okay. I'm not sure what that means. This, this, this question. Off. <laughs> you have a thing, I'll have a drink. Oh. I'd have to say that it's probably a mix. I think I'm I'm happy being around people and then I'm also happy being on my own. So, I don't know. I have to be able to do both in That's my good. Yeah. I think that's really good. Yeah. I need to mix it up more. I'm always the crazy one with my friends. Are you? <laughs> Yeah. Oh my gosh. What's some craziness that's happened with like friends? Like what's a... Oh, you don't want to know. Oh, yeah, okay. Just we'll say those two or three. Sure. We'll say those stories you'll... for another time. Yeah. You'll find out. Okay. Okay. You'll find yeah. out. <clears throat> Bad video connection there. Sorry. No, no worries, it's fine. So, how long have you been here, Maya? Like two years. I was I was traveling around Europe with my ex, and then we just got to London. We decided to settle here. So. Wow, that's a that's a big step. Well, we were together since we were teenagers, so we're still friends. We're very close. He lives near here. Oh, he does. What, what was it? Uh, was it a recent breakup? Yeah, um, it was about a week ago. I'm joking. It was like a year ago. Oh my <laughs> gosh. That's, that's quite she soon knows. after you got here though. It's true, true. Yeah, well, it's you know, it's humor. different when you're traveling. It's, it's just like fun and we got to London. It was like the real world, you know, it just was too much. It was too much for us. Yeah, yeah. And what, so, and have you been single since? Yes, I have. <laughs> um, but you know, I'm hoping to find my London boy on the app. Oh, so, so you're into London guys, yeah? Maybe, maybe. Anyway, I just feel like London people need to smile more, right? It's like you get on the bus or the train and like 
everyone just looks miserable. <laughs> Trust me, it's the weather. Don't even talk to me about the weather in this country. <laughs> talk about something else. It's like, no. Okay. There's quite a lot I've been, I've been wondering about you, actually, just hearing you talk about certain things. Really? Just... Maybe made the wrong choice. I'm mystifying there, but... <laughs> you, okay? Yes, somewhat. Ask me anything. Okay, uh, okay, then question number one, what's in the glass? Oh, <laughs> uh, it's just some red wine. That's my favorite. Anything in particular? Uh, no, I don't really care, no. to be honest, as long as they get me speed wrong. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> that's so bad. I know I should know more, I should know more. I used to work in a wine bar. Maybe that's why I got fired, yeah. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> oh, but you're not drinking, right? Okay, so I wasn't sure about the first video date protocol. Come on, man. A drink always helps, you know, you get to know someone better. Okay, yeah, but they don't need to. And we've covered a lot of ground so far, haven't we? Oh my God, so you're like a monk, huh? No. <laughs> I almost look so like uncivilized to you. It's, it's uh, uncivilized? Is it uncivilian? Un got, got it. Yeah. Okay, um, how's this online digital dating thing going for you? Have you enjoyed it? It's okay. I mean, I love going out and meeting people, but like, it's it's a good, it's a close second. That's a, that must be pretty weird. I bet you're excited to just jump back out and get into the real world again. Yeah, kind of, but like, I think it's actually been good for me to like weed out the bad ones. Sure. So when I do, it's like, you know. Nice, nice. I'm glad. Yeah. Boy, Maya, I finally scored some weed. Oh, really? I managed to find the only dealer working through lockdown. Come on, let's light up. Okay, I'm coming. Awkward. Hope it's going well with Tom. <laughs> um. Me, Tom. I'm a Tom. Um. Do you know what actually is cool? I think I've, I've, people have always said that I look like a Tom. Oh. <laughs> Trust me, you're much better looking than Tom. Um, okay, uh, thank you, <laughs> I think. No, well, who is Tom anyway? Is he like another... I In don't fact, know, you know what? He, he... Forget Tom, he... I don't want to know about right. Tom. He's exactly. whatever. Exactly, my flatmate's an idiot and he just doesn't know what he's talking about. <sighs> Maya, I'm smoking this entire bag if you don't come now. I'm coming, I'm coming. Sorry. You gotta go. I do. Um, no, it's fine. I'm so sorry. I told him that if he got some weed, that I would just smoke it with him straight away. No, it's no problem at all. We had, um, listen, we had a great chat this evening. Yeah, definitely. I mean, um, I think you're really cool, so. Yeah, I think <laughs> you're cool too. Um, okay, well, see you later. I'll see you later. Bye, bye. So at the end of date one, she's uh, run off to smoke some weed <laughs> rather than carry on the conversation. I suppose most people's into that sort of thing, they each to their own. Hi there. Uh, go on, uh, sorry, ladies first. Um, hi, um, I'm Shana. <laughs> Shana, nice to meet you. I mean, at least we're both a similar level of punctual. Yeah, and I was worried I was going to be late. I hadn't really figured out how to use this dating app. Join the club. I just downloaded this thing this morning, so... Mm. <laughs> um, so, uh, I don't think it's wrong, but you're from up north, right? Yeah, good good spot. Um, from Leeds. Okay, but your, your profile said that you live in London? Yeah, no, I do. Um, my parents moved down here a couple of years ago to be closer to their parents. So, yeah, but needless to say, the house was a bit of a downsize. One second. Sorry, 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 one second. No, it's all right. You go ahead. Angie. Angie. Hey, G. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, it's um, okay. You didn't hear that, did you? Literally, not a word. What, what, what was it about me? God, no. I don't tell my parents about guys that I'm talking to on dating apps. Oh wait, so you're living with your parents during lockdown? But you're you're a frontline nurse. How how is that working? It's not ideal, but um, I could have gone to a hotel, but I thought I needed to be closer to him to make sure that they're all right. Yeah. I kind of just self-isolate. I come in through the back and 
and just come straight to my room. Okay, so no contact whatsoever, basically? Nope. Just nice. that shouting that you heard. <laughs> <laughs> How about you? Real life. There's a lot um, of people going through you that work now, in healthcare, healthcare, don't you? How's it for you? Yeah, I do, but um, it's sort of easier for me because I live alone. And how are the hours them. for you? I mean, uh, preaching to the choir here, but horrific some days. But that's what we're here for, right? This is um, this is the first day off I've had in, I don't know, like about four or five weeks. You're joking. Well, listen, I thank you for choosing to spend some of it with me. Likewise. So this living at home situation, how long has that been going on for? Um, forever. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I really get on with my family and, well, I'm actually just saving up for my own place and, well, like, for in London and on a nurse's wage, that is just, it's going to take me forever, so, yeah, so I'm living here for the foreseeable future. But listen, I just have to say amen to it because... <laughs> Yeah, but how is the saving going? It... Really, really, really well, really well. Um, I might just be able to afford a cozy cupboard, <laughs> uh, but I'm actually quite good at saving. I just, I just like the odd luxury, like anyone else. Oh, okay. Such as? Such as um, trainers. I'm always on my feet all day, so I like a comfy kick. No, it makes sense. If you're walking around loads, and listen, you have to, I feel like you have to spend your money on something. You've got to enjoy it somehow, especially you working probably incredibly hard, so. I mean, I've got loads. <laughs> so, you live on your own, right? Yeah. Are you renting or do you own it? Well, sorry, either way, it looks really nice. From the bit I can oh, see. You like, <laughs> you, from the bit you can see, you like. Yeah, the bit you've tidied up for this, it looks really good. This place is so extortionate, though. I mean, my, my landlord's eased up on the rent during lockdown, but it just eats into my bank account every month. I don't know how you do it. Like, all my friends had the same issue at your age. Like, the struggle is real. I won't be able to do it. Hats off to you. Yeah, it's... Again, I'm just... Some people don't have a roof over their head right now. No. And so, I mean, I'm one of the lucky ones, regardless, so... It's true. You know. So, I figured I'd just address the elephant in the room. There's an elephant. Well, hopefully I'm the only one that can see it. How do you feel about the cougar sitting opposite you being three years your senior? <laughs> OK, uh, it genuinely makes no difference to me. What about you? No, there's no problem on my end. As long as you mature and you're not expecting a sugar mama. <laughs> OK, no, 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 that's reasonable. No. Have you ever dated someone older? Or, like, what age range do you actually date if there is one? You're delving in here, aren't you? Uh, I'm going to put you somewhere to go. I haven't really. I see where that I think I've us. considered it too much. Relationships have kind of eluded me. What? So you've you've never been in one? Nope, never. So you've never experienced that type of commitment. I'm really surprised. Like uh, uh, in a good way, or? Um, just surprised. Jenna. Okay. Um, Jenna. Sorry. Jenna. One second, sorry. It's all right, go for it. Jenna? Yeah? Okay. That should hold him off for a while. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, where was he? Okay, sorry for the chat escalating so quickly. Oh, no, my goodness, that's all right. Small talk is boring anyway. I just think it's stuff that should be out in the open, you know, from the very start for both of us. So, now, now, look, now you can interrogate me as you see fit. <sighs> okay, all right, I won't do that. I'm not going to grill you, but no, there are a couple of things that I was wondering. Time something off. in particular. Okay, go for it. Maybe I'll put you on the spot a little bit with this one. Um... Why don't you tell me something funny? Whoa, um, that's a lot of pressure. Okay, no, no, I know I kind of just blurted that out, but... Okay, all right, so what are you looking for, like an anecdote or a dirty joke? Because, like, I'm not a comic, but, you know, I could just try and scrape some of it together. Oh, okay, but, but there's material <laughs> floating around. <laughs> just around. go for the first got one. stuff hidden away. <laughs> okay, I'll, why don't we go with an anecdote? Yeah. Okay. Okay, right. Right, okay, so last winter I was looking after my baby nephew Ashish 
Um, I had a date in the evening, okay. so I was wearing my best, like my favourite white park, and I took him to the park. We were playing on the swings all day, pushing him around, picking him up, as you do. Uh, spent the whole day with him, then uh, took him back to my sister's house just quickly. As soon as she came in, just dashed out the house, didn't speak to her, passed the baby, and left for my date. Then I get all the way to my date, and I went to go hug him, as you do, and he sort of like moved back in disgust. Well, why? <laughs> well, naturally, I just were like, huh? Looked at myself, looked down, and there was sort of like a yellow stain down my coat. <laughs> and so obviously, she should just relieved himself at some no. point, and I was in such. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> oh, gosh, no way. Oh, no. And, and what you say, so you didn't smell it or anything? I broke my nose when I was younger, so I cannot smell anything. And did no one think to tell you that you had pee on you? Well, no, but then I was in such a rush. I mean, I probably got some funny looks, but I just didn't even realise at the time. It was so disgusting. Okay, so what happened with the date? That's okay, actually, fair play to him because he just absolutely cracked on. He just got drunk, just didn't even mention it again. and just took the jacket off, didn't even mention it. He was like, shit, how am I going to unsee this? And he probably got absolutely smashed. <laughs> yeah, and we're going to make a, make a night of this absolute mess. That's funny. Okay, well done, yeah, that's, that's pretty good. Yeah. Oh, that is so rude. I'm so sorry. Listen, you have a free pass to be tired, all things considered. Oh, you know, it's been keeping me sane throughout the whole of this. I've been making myself a cocktail every night. So um, I basically come back from work, sneak into the kitchen, make myself a really good cocktail, sanitise everything, drink it, and then that just knocks me out. Uh, you listen, you got to love a little ritual, right? I've actually become quite the mixologist now. Have you? Better with vodka, whiskey and gin. Nice. So, what's your favourite out of those? <sighs> what actually would uh, I make? I'm going to put them as a, a gin mm, drinker, I think. What would you make for me? Which one would I choose? What's your... What could you do with gin? If I went gin, what could you do me with gin in it? What could I do with gin? A lot of things, right? But actually, okay. there's a really, really um, classic British cocktail called Bramble. A what? A what ball? <laughs> a what ball? Sorry, sorry. A Bramble. Okay, a so bramble. you've never had a Bramble. No, yeah, okay, bramble. no, never okay. had it. It's actually super simple. So you have crushed blackberries, a bit of gin, lemon juice, nice. a tablespoon of sugar syrup, uh, ice, creme de mer, and a slice of lemon to garnish. Mm. Uh, that does not sound simple at all. <laughs> no. oh, it's perfect now that summer's rolling in. Ooh, sounds nice. Well, trust me, that would be very gratefully received these Shana? days. Shana? Sorry. Oh, she can show that again. Nearly 8 p.m. Shana, time to go and clap. Oh. Sorry, it's oh, nearly 8pm, I'm going to so have to go outside and do the clap for the NHS. Like okay, likewise. April, mate, yeah. when we were doing all that, I, uh, the 8 o'clock NHS. I hope you had a good time tonight. Yeah, I did, thanks. And you too. Oh. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay, cool. <laughs> so that was our end of our second date. So as you can see, it is current. Well, just a few months behind with the current COVID-19 pandemic. I know we're all sick of it. Um, but it's good that the games like this have come to to give us a chance to interact and still enjoy games and reflect what's going on in the real world. Um, you know, we're all living through it in different situations. And video date naps, um, they, they, they probably have took off. I think they have gone up in a certain percentage. A lot of people trying them out. Obviously, you can't go out and beat real people in real life that much now. Hopefully, it gets back to some sort of normality soon. <laughs> Saffron. Vinny! <laughs> Hi! Hi! I'm so glad you're still there. Sorry I'm late. No, no, no it's fine. Yeah, okay, sorry. I was just doing yoga and I like completely zoned out. Do you mind if I just tidy this up for one time? I'll be really quick. No, please, please, go ahead. Thank you, sir. I have to turn on plates. Tell you what I'm gonna do. Just gonna light some incense because there is some very sweaty energy in here. <laughs> Alright. It's better. Nice. 
Okay. I'm with you. I think it's pretty uh, It's pretty cool that you're keeping active during lockdown. Oh my gosh, it's like the only way I could keep my equilibrium. <laughs> Have you been like keeping active or doing any exercise during lockdown at all? Like what, just walking uh, or? We're gonna put- <laughs> <laughs> Anything, any kind of exercise, exercise just going keeping out. active. Keeping limber. Yeah, actually, uh, I have. I've been going on runs, um, like running, uh, and I just started. <laughs> I don't know if I did that. I just started hitting five k. Um, just any excuse to get outside, really. So. Well, how have the five k's been coming along? Am I enjoying them or am I getting faster? <gasps> well, are you for? happy with your times? I'm not happy with my times. Do you know, I don't really bother recording them. I, I guess I just sort of run to feel good. Wait, right, so you run just like purely for self-care? Yeah. Huh, that's a really measured out. A lot of people just end up getting like really competitive. Yeah, that's sort of, that's definitely not me. I'm sort of, I'm the other end of the spectrum, to be honest. Hmm, I like that. Well, listen, thank you for breaking the ice, Saffron. My specialty. So, I haven't asked, what is it that you do for a living you know, when you're not breaking the ice? Um, I'm a project manager for an animal welfare charity. Oh my goodness, that's really cool. I've actually been a vegan for about 10 years. Do you mind if I ask what you eat? No, no, not at all. It's, um, it's a very important detail right now, isn't it? More than <laughs> Pretty much vegetarian. every relationship <laughs> in life. <laughs> I've actually been a vegetarian for a few years now. Oh, well, do you reckon you could take the next step to veganism? Do you know what? I I just don't know enough about it, to be honest. Well, I won't try to brainwash you. Vegetarianism definitely makes things easier. <laughs> Where are your eyes wandering off to? <laughs> your, uh, your living room is... Confusing. Eccentric. <laughs> no, fascinating. What interests you most? Uh, we'll see a photographs. Those photos over there. Oh yeah. They're from when I went traveling. They're shot on film. Oh, that's cool. Eh. <laughs> so, the gorgeous girl is Sally and the guy is Derek. Wicked. And how long were you how long were you out there for? We actually had that for quite a while. I think it was about six months or something. Jeez, that's pretty cool. That's so cool. And who's uh, who's Sally? Sally is actually an ex of mine. <laughs> I think we were dating at this point. Interesting. Looks like it. <laughs> oh, you, you're bi. Yeah. Is that a problem? A problem? We'll just say no. Yeah. Is that <laughs> okay with you? I'm literally all for it. <laughs> Most guys are. Although some find it threatening. Uh, I don't know, maybe because guys are the fairer sex? <laughs> Nonsense. I'm definitely just more attracted to like the mind rather than any kind of like gender. Mm. I think they call it sapiosexual. I think it's something like that. That's pretty cool though, that you're open-minded like that and it's just, you're attracted to who you're attracted to. I think that's wicked. Yeah, totally. Anyway, I've spoken way too much, so it's your turn to tell me about you. Ah, uh, I'm really not great at talking about myself. Oh, <sighs> you know what we could do? There's this ultimate compatibility test that's only three questions. Do you want to do it? Okay, let's go for it. Okay, so question one is, do you like horror films? Ooh. I just have to give a simple yes or no answer, yeah? No. Mm-hmm. Very straightforward. But we'll put no for this. Nah, it's not really my thing, if I'm honest. Yes. Same! You don't like me, We are off to a good start. No, I hate it. <sighs> Gosh, I hate when one person <laughs> likes a certain thing and the other person I don't trust it. people that like horror films. You don't, neither do I. I. Honestly, no. I'm running away from horror. I'm not trying to go deeper Literally, into it. Literally, you know? exactly. <laughs> so, uh, have you ever traveled to another country alone? Ooh, I think I have to think about that for a second. Um, yeah, I know, it's kind of hard to remember that kind of stuff. No. 
In that department, I think we are as boring as each other. <laughs> you as well? You haven't travelled? No. Well, listen, nothing beats a travel buddy, right? Yeah, exactly. Finally, could you pack up your life and live on a boat? Wow, now that is a left field question. Just imagine yourself, yeah, completely alone. Is, completely isolated, anyway, mm -hmm. again. Floating along. Do you know what? I reckon I could. I think I'm a pretty low-key guy at the best of times and I'm thinking about it now and that sort of tranquility is probably a bit of me. But, okay, disclaimer, my sea legs aren't great, <laughs> but I guess that's just something you'll get used to. Yeah, no, same. I could do it in a heartbeat. I feel like lockdown is when you can practice. No, 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 I'm there. I'm there with you. We got top marks. Looks like we're very compatible. I think we are. I think we're going to get married. Oh my God. You, I've been thinking that this, the whole time we've been talking, I've been thinking, <laughs> yeah, probably going to I mean, do you really trust all these personality tests? <laughs> Vinny, just because I'm a hipster, it doesn't mean that I base my life off obtuse thinking <sighs> and mysticism. Okay, no, no, you're right. However, I did actually notice that our star signs are super compatible. That's good. This is a good sign. 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 Thank you so much for this evening, Vinny. I had a really lovely time getting to know you. I'll see you in a day too, then. Really beautiful energy. Thank you, Saffron. So do you. And uh, yeah, it was just a, a real pleasure talking to you. Day two? Oh, day three. <laughs> Get there. I'm back on my tail there. Right, that's day three. So he's going to check in with Carl. Whoa! Quick answer. Hey, mate, I've been on tental hooks for this debrief, man. You were just waiting in bed for me to call you, weren't you? Bro, stop deflecting, man. Details, details. So there was Maya. Uh. And, man, she was a real live wire from Spain. From Spain? Ho, ho. Hey, you got to love the mamacitas. <laughs> How'd it go? How'd it go? Do you know what? Uh-huh. It was great. She seemed really cool. And I think... I think she's into me. That's my boy. Yeah. Well done. Well done, boy. <laughs> I can't stop smiling. Um, uh, we need to do some more digging on her, man. Surname? Oh, I don't know. Give me something oh, to work with, man. Uh, she's Spanish, obviously. Uh, she's a language Facebook, teacher Instagram. in French sort of and Italian. Idea who they are, the Does that help? Sort of thing. Boom! Got her. You got Online her. language tuition database, Maya Orantes from Granada. Oh, -ho! okay. Yes. Uh, hold on. Let me let me see if this is her. Yeah. Oh, uh, this is her. This is her. This is her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm a genius. The profile <laughs> pictures. Yeah. You just scroll up and down the the uh, left thumb stick. Just press A to continue. See what you need to see. Yeah, man. Alright, alright. Sweet. Next one. So Shayna, frontline nurse. God bless her. Yeah, like really had all her stuff worked out and she's a bit older as well. Oh, experience lad. No substitute for it. So, good day. Okay, if I was to be honest about it, it it's just too early to tell, I reckon. Okay, okay. It sounds like there's still something in it for you, bruv. Yeah. No, 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 there definitely is. And yeah, exactly, man. It sounds promising. That's what it sounds like. It sounds like, you know what? You can win this on aggregate. <laughs> you found anything else about her online? Uh, no, I didn't even get a surname. And that would be easy if she's NHS. Well, let me know what you find. Uh, Shayna Saha? That could be her. Okay, let me check to see if she's on socials or anything. Um, Shana, uh, is there no profile for that one? No, nothing's coming up, I don't think. You get what you need? Again. No, there's actually nothing. Ah. Not on social media, nothing. No. Damn. So, Saffron, yeah, um, where to start? She had a lot going on. She had this super cool hipster vibe. Okay. And... Do you know what? 
Oh, uh, no. Was it was it terrible? It went really well, man. <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. Yes, yes. I am proud of you, mate. Yeah? Vinny is proud. Oh, no. I said my name is Vinny. Shit. <laughs> I am proud of you, my guy. Listen, Callum is proud of Vinny. Vinny should feel vindicated. <laughs> you get anything else? Surname? Anything? So just a job, but I reckon I could find it. There can't be too many saffrons nearby. Okay. Hold on, I'm just gonna have a look now. I found her, That's I it. found her. Ah. Yeah, this is her. She's mm. definitely into saving the planet and that sort of thing as well. Yep. You get what you need? I think so. All right, bro. That's you then. Well, just remember, mate, you've now got to tell the app which two girls that you liked so you can ask them out on the second day. Do I? Oh, well, this is where it's narrowing oh, down from the first three to two. I don't know. To stop girls getting strung along and catching feelings. Bro, I don't know. I didn't make the app. Just, just answer. I need to think on it. Um, but listen, thank you for your help. And I'm going to get some sleep and I'll catch you tomorrow. Yeah? No problem, bro. Have a good one, yeah? See you later. Good night. So we can either pick Maya, Saffron or Shana. We want to pick two of them. I'm going to pick Saffron. And I'm going to pick Shana. The reason I'm going to drop Maya is because of the the weed situation. Not into that, personally, at all. <laughs> I know it's just a game, but... Never mind, everyone makes their own choices. So these two have accepted second dates. So these are... Game dates. Of course! Right where I expect you to be. Bro, I've been killing these kill streaks recently, fam. So, listen, I've got my second date with Saffron tonight. Nice work. What's the game? Uh, I think... Tarot, tarot reading? Tarot reading? I think that's... Oh, um, those cards that people use to tell their future. That's the one, that's the one. Yeah, I'm kind of just approaching it with an open mind. It's the best way to be, bro. Have you chatted since the first date? You're going to hate me, but... <laughs> She's actually sent me a vegan recipe over the app and I'm cooking it right now. Like it's a cauliflower. Oh, Christ. <laughs> uh, actually smells pretty I've good. Enough. You know what? Call me later, vegan. <laughs> uh, get your cucumber ass out of it. All right, cool. I'll check you in a bit. I'll let you know how it tastes. Bye. So when we're ready, we can enter our video date with Saffron. So this is the second date. She's doing some tarot reading. Let's see how this goes. Okay. Knock knock. Oh my god. Hey, <laughs> sorry. I thought I better be early because of last time. No, no, no. No, you're alright. Oh, and thank you for doing a tarot reading, by the way. I like was looking at the other games. I've never done like, in real life. Tarot a little bit different. I don't even yeah, listen, I don't know much about it, but I'm a willing guinea pig. You are an intrigued you young know. man. Okay, should we just do this? I'm quite excited. Yes. Okay. So, this is my tarot deck. Nice. Um, tarot deck should be like really personal to their owner. Um, it sort of acts as a vessel of their energy to give like an authentic reading. So like kind of like um, an energy sponge. Yeah, I mean, there are very different types of readings that you can do. Um, but for today, I'm just going to do like a simple general reading that goes into your past, present and future. Do you know what? Sorry, I thought that they only told the future. That is a common misconception. They actually don't tell you anything um, at all, really. <laughs> it's not... Hey! No, they just like bring up stuff in your life um, that you can sort of delve into and consider. Cool, listen, let's just get delving. Okay. So, um, the first two cards I pick out are going to pertain to the past. Okay. Nervous. You shouldn't be. <laughs> okay. Okay. Which card are you more drawn to? 
the moon or the page of pentacles. Okay, and uh, you're not going to give me any tips, right? Like, you're not going to tell mm -hmm. me which one is better and uh, it's going to no tell idea. me I'm more amazing. Completely random. <laughs> That's not how this works. Okay, uh, page of pentacles. Ugh, oh, I love this card. Okay, upright or reverse? Oh, uh, um, we'll let's go upright. Yeah, upright? Yeah. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, 100%, <laughs> okay. I'm sure. So this way up, the Page of Pentacles represents ambition, diligence, and desire. This sounds good. Do those themes feature heavily in your past? It could be in you or in others around you. So you can engage the choices. Let me the think about this. I'm put engage for now. See what it comes up with. They, yeah, they did actually. Um, I had a really good friend uh, back in school, and he used to beat me in all of these tests. But he used to let me copy his homework. Oh, well, well done for him for sharing the wealth. Oh no, exactly. I mean, without him, I honestly would have failed all of my exams. <laughs> I rem I remember asking him how he got so smart, and he said he wasn't. He just worked harder than everybody else. So he kind of raised the bar for me. So instead of trying to copy him all the time, I decided to compete with him to try and match this kid's amazing, amazing brain. <laughs> kind of got about the same grades, I think. That's so great. And he was, yeah, he was just super excited that we had succeeded together, so. Mm, I love that. He taught me that drive and ambition can be collaborative. And that was a, I think that's a really important lesson. Yeah. He, uh, he passed away last year. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. He really made a big impact on my life. So, I guess thank you for reminding me of that wonderful time and him and that memory. So this is my present. It is indeed. Okay. All right. Okay, the tower or the two of swords. Good looking cards. Oh, see a swords. Um, see what comes of this. I like two of swords. Two of swords? Yeah, I'm going with that. So this is actually my favorite card. <laughs> Upright or reversed? We'll just see oh god, again. I always get nervous picking this one for some reason. Wolf looked the same. I think fair. upright. Upright? Upright, yeah. Okay. Okay, so this card tells me that your current self is riddled with indecisions, solutions, and difficulties. Is any of that ringing a bell? Okay, well, there's a lot going on there. Um, yeah. No, I think they don't necessarily need to apply to you. Could be okay. Others around you, or yeah. Nothing relevant to me in there. Sorry. Hmm. Maybe I haven't got the gift. No, no, no. Maybe I'm just bland. <laughs> okay. No, I definitely wouldn't say that. <gasps> right into the future we go. Okay, let's go. Let's you go. You ready? Yeah, I am. I think. <laughs> Okay, my guess about my future is as good as yours, so I guess this is where the real mysticism starts, right? Wow, these are just like feelings I get. Um, you yeah, know, maybe they'll just focus your attention on an outcome you'll want to like achieve or avoid. Sure. Okay. <sighs> it makes me nervous when you do that. That was this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, Seven of Cups. Or the four of ones. Four of four of ones or seven of cups. Um, uh, what do you like? Four of ones, I think. I've not. Like I, said, I have no idea. No idea. Okay, purely for the magic, I'm going with four of ones. Four of ones. Okay. Yeah. <gasps> upright or reversed? We'll just we'll fight again. I feel like they kind of look the same, but you just got to go with what you feel. Okay, upright. Upright. Do you think upright? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> upright? Upright. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. This is actually a really lovely one. Um, 
Good. I see peace, happiness, and harmony encompassing all aspects of your life. This is great. Everybody just wants like that one? Just want happy life. <laughs> no dramas. It's hard to imagine this now, but this pandemic will come to an end and life will go on. And I have I have just every intention of working towards the goal you just described. Wow. Yeah, I think that's amazing that you think that that's like achievable. A lot of people don't think that they'll like ever attain it. I don't know why. No, I agree. And I think this time, this period of time that we're in now, that can do that to you. But yeah, to come totally. out maybe with a, a bit of optimism, which is so cringy, I know, to say, but just some hope. Do you know what I mean? I think we're all well, fair, thanks for being so open with me with this situation. stuff. Um, not everyone is. No, it was all pretty insightful, I have to admit. I learned a lot about you. Good stuff, I hope. Oh, exclusively. Okay, good. <laughs> you, um, you articulate your emotions well. Oh, that's cool. That's good to, that's good to know. Okay, I'm not allowing this whole date to be about me. What? It hasn't. Okay, listen, what we're doing now is we're going to switch roles. You want to do a reading on me? Yep. <laughs> and we're just going to see what we come up with. And you can laugh at me if you want. Okay, you don't have a deck? You're just going to improvise. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> okay, how about you pick a card and then I'll, inter <laughs> I'll interpret it for you. <laughs> well, that is not how this works, but... Let's see what we get. Who knows? I might actually be really good at this. So yeah, sure. Maybe. Okay, yeah, you shuffle them. And I'm <laughs> going to do that breathing thing that you do that. <laughs> oh no. Someone's <laughs> attack. <laughs> Stefan, are you okay? <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, I'm not okay, I'm not okay. I'm so hot. I'm so hot, I'm so hot. Uh, <laughs> Saffron? <laughs> Saffron, is there any, is it? <laughs> Saffron. Situation will be put. <laughs> if it does happen, please don't try to keep calm. Okay, Saffron, listen to me, right? You're fine. You're fine, oh, I promise no, you. No, no, I'm gonna die. No, 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 listen to me. I promise you right now, you're not gonna die, okay? I'm not gonna go anywhere. I'm gonna stay right here on the other side of this school, okay? So take a minute and it's fine, all right? I'm right here. I'm so sorry, Vinny. I'm so embarrassed. Honestly, don't be, all right? We've all got shit to deal with, and the support is what's most important, so I'm just, I'm just glad I could be here for you. Thank you for staying. <laughs> You'll be unkind. I, I understand if this is all too much for you. Please don't even think about it. On okay? a second day as well. Um, Listen, why don't you just go chill out, get some rest? Yeah, sorry. I'm, I'm just going to go to bed. It's fine. You're a gem. Um, good night. Good night, Saffron. And take care of yourself, yeah? Fuck, man. How did he even know how to deal with a panic attack? I, I didn't. <laughs> I guess I just... I, I did what I would want in that scenario, which is not be left alone. Hey, you are a top, top man for that, man. Well done. Seriously. I just hope she's okay, man. I hear that, man. But what a difficult thing to have to struggle with, you know? 
Look, obviously, this is something you have to consider whether you can handle or not. Of course. Um, I have to be all in. It wouldn't be fair to either of us otherwise. Mm. So, how was the date going before that? I have to say that it was going great. Hey. Um, she's into some really different stuff, but I, Callum, I just, I, I love it. And I think that I'll really broaden my horizons with her. Wow. <laughs> I never thought that I would hear those words coming out in your mouth, bruv. That's big. Neither did I, but mm. I had a lot to learn from her, and hopefully she had something to learn from me, but... I don't know what she's going to learn from you, but yeah. 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 Man, that's good, man. <laughs> I think you could actually learn a lot from me, and, uh, you know... Oh, is it? <laughs> <sighs> All right, man. Hey, I'm hitting the sack, man. <laughs> you got some things to do tomorrow, and I hope that goes well for you. Yeah, I back myself. Mm. Mm. So what do you need me for? Everything else. <laughs> Everything else in my life. Yes. I need. That's right. That's right. Nah, as always, I appreciate you, man. Love, man. Take care, man. Yeah, I shall. Right. Peace. Bye-bye. So Shana's scheduled a quiz for the second date. <laughs> Callum, are you serious? You're doing a hit session without me? Yeah, no time for slackers, mate. Alright, fair play. Um, I have a second date tonight. Nice. With who? A uh, Shayna, the nurse. Ah, oh, poor her. Having to deal with the pandemic during the day and then deal with you in the evenings. <laughs> yeah, we're doing one of those um, those quiz activities on the app. Oh, hey, don't embarrass yourself, you know. Yeah, listen, you don't need to worry about my general knowledge, alright? Anyways, have you not chatted otherwise? We haven't, but that's understandable, right? Yeah, definitely. She must be so busy right now. Consider yourself lucky. Mm. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm going to let you carry on with whatever it is that you're attempting to do. Uh, good luck. Uh, <laughs> I'll catch you later. Uh, Come on, I'll call you after. So we're ready to uh, join this one. You do, I think there is an option where you can decline dates as well. You know, if you weren't happy with the way it was progressing. Still up, I think, on this one. Oh, she's a bit late. Maybe call the way with uh, emergency at work. She's front line nurse. All things do happen. Hey, no, 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 no. You must be the first guy ever to be stood up on a video day. <laughs> Shut up, man. Hey, no, hey, no, no, seriously, yeah, seriously. She must have been like called in early for an emergency shift or something like that, man. Yeah, but she could have just messaged on the app or something. Ah, oh, come on, man. She must be mad busy, mad rushed. Or, or she wants me to take a hint. Bye. Mm. I guess that might be true, I suppose, yeah. No, no, sorry, you're not supposed to say it. You're supposed to go, no, 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 that's definitely not true. Hey, hey, do you want the truth or do you want do you want me blowing roses up your ass? What do you want, truth or roses? Exactly. Roses, please. Yeah. <laughs> Shayna, hey. Hi. You're right. Hi. Um, yeah, look, I want to say sorry for yesterday. I got called into work on an emergency shift. Listen, I, I, I kind of guess, so it's cool. Yeah. Yeah, still, still, but I'm sorry and I hope you weren't too inconvenienced. Oh my goodness, no, not at all. Um, how are you? Are you okay? Yeah. Shattered. Shattered, but good. You look it. Shattered or good? Good. <laughs> good. You don't look shattered at all. You look very, very good. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm not buying it, though. Um, uh, look, I might as well be up front with you. 
my job has got like unsociable and unpredictable hours and that's just going to be amplified for the foreseeable future which makes it really difficult to date so i i guess i understand if you can't be bothered with that just um it's just a shame because i was really looking forward to that quiz so was i i don't suppose you're free now um so I'm just thinking about what's... Oh no, sorry, you're probably busy, it's midday. People have things to do. Let's do it. Screw it. Yes. I'm up for it. Right, okay. What's the quiz topic? Uh, what, is it like general knowledge or...? Each other. Mm -hmm. As in us? Yep. <laughs> you mean me and you, just after, after one day? Yep, I thought what better way to get to know each other than to make educated guesses about what we're into. Okay, fair enough. Let's give this a go. I'm done. I think the quiz will start if I just... There will be three questions, each with three answers. You must guess the other person's answer. The correct answer shall be revealed after each question. Okay. All right. Should I click the first one? Yeah. All right, cool. Okay, here we go. What is Shana's favourite holiday answers from these the options? Oh, have you picked, yeah? You picked. Yeah, yeah. Okay, sorry, I've chosen mine. Do you think it is? No pressure, no pressure. Uh, Christmas is a bit obvious. You're sweating. That's sorry, are you trash talking over a quiz? Sorry, apologies. <laughs> okay, I don't know. I'm thinking the whole family wholesome vibe is sort of too obvious. So maybe I'll go with. Okay. Come on! Oh, very perceptive. I feel like you throw together a mean costume as well. Yeah, I, I do actually as well. I go all out. I've got like glitter, sewing, sewing machine, face paint, a lot. Amazing. It's good to know. <laughs> okay, your turn. So, so just was pick your answer and then I'll have a guess. Okay, go for it. Right. Question two. Yeah. Ooh, what is Billy's political outlook? Oh, shit. That's a personal one. Uh, mm. What's called moderate? Ooh. Ooh, okay. Um, Boom. Done. Right. I'm answering with my outlook. Let's see if they align. Same. Ooh. Well done. Well done. So, I mean, that's kind of, that's definitely avoided some awkwardness. Well, I'm pretty centrist, so I'm sure we'll align on most things. I think so. And loads of stuff we can get into at a later date, so. Good shout. Shall I hit the next one? Yeah, go for it. Okay, cool. All right. This one's good. Okay, what is Shayna most scared of? Easy. Oh, have you picked? Yeah, easy. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Every person who's usually scared of spiders would say that. Kind of. Okay. I ha okay, it's got to be these then. Surely. <laughs> Yes! <laughs> nice! I hate even just talking about, oh, they make me, they actually make my skin crawl just thinking, oh, I can't even, I actually can't even talk about them. Okay, well, we, we, we no, we'd make a good team. Why? Because I, yeah, I'm a good spider catcher. Oh, I thought you were going to say you love spiders and you'd help me. No, yeah, cool. You don't kill them, though, do you? No, no, I never kill them. I always catch them in like a cup and then I release them back into the wild. I don't like them, but I don't want people to get, oh, I don't. Like, I think they're proper What is it that you don't like about them though? Just, what, the, the legs, the look? Like, they're so creepy. What if they just come on your hair and like lay eggs in your head and they, ugh, 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 that's it, done. This is the silly myth. Nope. Okay, question fine, four, we'll move on. Four. I'm about to move on. Uh, Vinny's favorite ice cream flavor. Okay, that's a nice one for me. <laughs> nice. Just thinking of you mentioning anything. Uh, vanilla. <laughs> Okay, I could have this any day of the week. There we go. There you go. Now I know you said, now you said it. There you go. Yeah. Yes. Okay, <laughs> okay, well done. But why did you pick vanilla? What, do you think I'm bland? What? No. Maybe a little bit, a little bit, a tiny bit. Okay, for your information, I, I tell you why I like vanilla. I like vanilla because it's customizable. Customizable? Yes, because you, you can add things to vanilla ice cream. You can add chocolate chips, syrup, fruit. It, you merge things with vanilla ice cream. What's your favorite? Oh, it's gotta be cookie dough. Come on, tell me you love cookie dough. I can't say I don't like it. Them cookie bits that are not made in the middle are a little bit sickly. 
my heart is breaking right now. I cannot believe that this is going to be, just so you know, this is going to be a problem. No, it isn't because then that means that you can eat all of the cookie dough by yourself. You don't have to share it. Ah, there we go. Okay, good. I can't think I'm bland. Okay, anyway, next. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> what is Shayna's favourite sex position? <laughs> Shit, I knew I shouldn't give it permission for NSFW questions. Right. Rules are rules. Right. Uh, Go on. We'll just Go on, tell us. Done. 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 You done? Done. Done. You've chosen? Done. Yeah. Yeah. Don't think too hard. No, no, it's I'm fine. not, I'm not yeah. going to, do I? Uh, cool. Okay, there we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. So you're a control freak, yeah? Well, actually, actually, my, my favourite position isn't even on there, so I went to the one that was the most fun on that link. What the hell are you doing out there? I, should, I actually shouldn't be talking. I, I forgot. Oh, your parents. <laughs> your parents. <laughs> and I'm just going, my parents. Oh, so did your, is, is yours like a silent move? Is that why it's not on there? It's like a silent... <laughs> Maybe like a stare from across the room. Is that like your kind <laughs> It's not actually a physical thing. It's like a... <laughs> as, you, as you get a bit older, you just prefer to connect on an emotional level. <laughs> I don't know whether to be really excited about this or just terrified about this look that you do. You, don't, you mister, don't need to be anything on a second day. So let's move on. Let's move on. Okay, all right, we shall. Go for it. I'll go for it. Question six. Vinny's favourite time of day. Ooh, how gentile. What are these questions? I, we, I, okay, we cannot uh, accuse you of not switching things up. Nighttime, because the day so shifts off it. Polar opposites. You need to chill okay. out and do what you need to do. Time of day. Right. Oh, this, this is easy. You better get this. Okay, if you said it's... No, if you said it's easy, I, I've got it. Yes! <laughs> nice! Well done. But yeah, I'm a night out for sure. Right? I love the buzz and, and the, the quiet at night. And... And... Uh, and... I love talking to Shayna, obviously, because she's amazing. Yeah, 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 whatever. Right, let's move. Oh. Okay, what, is that it? Oh, that's the end of the quiz, yeah. Okay, so what do we do? Do you find out who the winner is now? Yeah, well, obviously. Right, let's see. Okay, okay. I'm... Ah, oh, gosh. How many points did I get? Oh, drum roll, please. Drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. Oh! Okay, that's... Yes, but it's not a win. It's not a win. I didn't win. I didn't win. I, I think it's a fair result. I think, I think a draw is a fair result. I'm okay with that. Right, all right, then handshake, virtual handshake. Do not leave me hanging. Oh, virtual through the screen, yeah? yeah okay, no, 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 no. Well, no, in real life, obviously through the screen. Well Ob done, well done. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> thank you for doing the quiz. Thanks for getting me to do it. No, thank you for thank you for like getting to eat your sandwich. It's still there, by the way. Just going stale by the second. Feel bad, stop. In all seriousness, a quiz was a great shout. Well done. Thank you. I absolutely love them. I just love them. I'm a bit of a wannabe brainiac at the best of times. Always want to get top grades. Always want to be the know-it-all. But do, do you think that comes from your parents? In your family? Mm, yeah, it was sort of like ingrained in me. And I think I'd be the same with my kids and their academics. Do you know what? It's expensive these days. I mean, if you want to go into higher education, I mean. Tell me about it. Like, my parents got off lightly with me and my sister because we got bursaries and scholarships, which we, we wouldn't have been able to do without it. Well, listen, it seems like they did a fine job on you guys. Thank you. Do you, do you want kids? Ooh, Shayna. Oh, sorry. Ah. Sorry. So a big, wow, bold oh, question there. No, Came it out. is. No, yeah, but, uh, yeah. <sighs> Let me think about this. Okay, I, I'm definitely getting there, but there's just so many things I want to achieve and experience before fatherhood. Yeah, but you're not, you're not, you're not far away from it. No, a few years maybe, but not right now. Yeah, well, that actually makes complete sense where you are in life. Because once you do it, that's it. You're raising this kid forever. And not that I'm old, but that's why I've waited, because it has to be the right, has to be with the right person, in the right circumstance. 
Shena. Oh. Shena. Sorry. I'm shopping yeah. ke liye ja rahe hain. Jaldi aao. Right, sorry, I need to go for the weekly food shop and I'm not sure when I'll get the next chance because of work and stuff, so... Yeah, I think no, no, no. To, uh, I understand. Our priorities. Now. I'm really glad that you were able to carve out this time for us. And it's probably best that we wrap up for now because, again, it was starting to head in a really serious direction. My bad. Yeah, I understand, it's fine. And this was all so fun. Thanks, Vinny. Right, well then, um, enjoy the rest of your day. You too, Shana, you too. Right, bye. See you later, bye-bye. Bye. That's cool that she made up for last night. Yeah, I've, and I've never had a lunch date before. Oh, okay. So, uh, how'd it go? If I had to sum up the date, Callum, it was great. It was... Okay. And the, the quiz was really fun. And listen, even though we didn't have that much time together, I think we really bounced off each other. Do you know? It sounds like she's really cool, man. Yeah, it all seems very chill and comfortable. And I could definitely see my... Self and her progressing. Wow, damn, you're saying a lot. It's like two dates, that's, that's a lot. Yeah, yeah. Get your thinking cap on, man. You've got some decisions to make. I do, some big ones, some important ones. Listen, I'm gonna head to bed, but I'll catch you tomorrow or something. That's a choice right, between Safran and Sheila. Have a good sleep. Safran All right, cool, the, man. Uh, good night. Peace. Thank you. The hipster type, and mm -hmm. Sheila is more down to earth. My nurse, does Decision time. I think the one he gelled the most with was actually Shana. We can actually decline if we want. If you wanted to just say, well, that's it, I don't want to do any more, you can decline. Pick Shana. She's not active, she'll be at work. You get a response. <coughs> says she's accepted the third date it's gonna be a dinner date it is the big dinner tonight <laughs> boy what's on the menu i'm ordering in something nice you're not coordinating with shana uh, her schedule man mm. you sure you're good with that i mean listen for the moment of course um but hopefully once we're through this crazy period of time it will become less of an obstacle elite mentality speaking of which so Obviously, the third date is something. I knew you were going to say this. It's nothing. If you were on an in-person third date, you'd have to be escalating. We're not on an in-person third date. Therefore, there's nothing to escalate, is there? There's got to be a way to do it. OK, I'm going to play it by ear. I'm going to read her vibe and see where it takes me. Unconventional. Good luck. Okay, cool. Listen, I'm going to go, but we'll debrief later, yeah? I'll let you know how it goes. Uh, give me a bell later, but uh, I might not pick up. What do you mean? Why? Your boy's only gone and got himself a little video date tonight. Are you serious? <laughs> no. <laughs> who? With who? When? What time? Whoa, 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 bro, my bro, my bro. Listen, listen, you know I like to keep it low key with that I stuff, but stay on my business. Um, uh, listen, unlike you, I'm not going to pry about this stuff. All right. Um, but good luck. Just to impress. Don't play video games. Enjoy okay, yourself. okay. I got <laughs> it. I got it, bro. <laughs> cool, man. I'll catch you later. Peace. Right, so this is the third date. Uh, dinner date. So what we've done is we have, well, I have took you through the full beginning of the game and I'm going to wrap it up with this third date. See where it goes. Hi. Hi. <laughs> How are you? I'm getting a lot better now. You just oh took an hour and a half to get through the <laughs> So? Unless you decline, of course. Oh, what are you munching on? He's talking oh, already. Right. Ooh, very nice. Uh, I grabbed a takeaway too. No idea what that is. Oh, so nice. You've got two worth chips. of discounts <laughs> are an absolute godsend right now. Discounts. Oof. I've been loading up on coffee all day long. I'm like wired all the time. I will be so gutted when I have to buy my own Americanos after this. And you know what? The staff at the food and coffee places are just so supportive. It really keeps me going. My barista ended up becoming like my counsellor today started like comforting me. Oh no, how come? Are you right? Um, well, I just felt a little bit, I guess you'll know this, I just felt a little bit overwhelmed. 
with everything that's been going on, I'd got quite good at dealing with um, the stuff and like, I guess being able to detach myself from the job, but recently it's just, it's got a lot. Listen, I, you know, I still can't detach myself from everything. And if it wasn't for my friend Callum distracting me, then I'd have, I'd have probably crumbled by now. But look, I mean, look at you. You're, I mean, when you're not on the ward, you're, you've self-isolated and you're looking after your parents. Yeah, it sounds, sounds kind of crazy when you say it like that. It's literally amazing. You're honestly one of the strongest people I've met through this whole thing. And, and trust me when I tell you, I've met some badasses. <laughs> Thank you. How's your fish and chips? Can't eat. Oh, I think she's gonna mute. Okay, I'm hold on, let me get my headphones, hold on. <laughs> Hello? Oh yeah, I was just singing. You missed me singing. Oh no no no, I did I didn't really want to hear this miss. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I've got you, I've got you. What have you got in your mug today? Oh, yeah, no, I'm not drinking that today. I have made myself something a little bit special. I made oh. myself a bramble. Oh, it, that, it, the bumble thingy, is that the Bones cocktail that you can Bumble? Oh, it's very gin, strong um, today. A bramble? Yes, a bramble. Uh, is that the one that you picked for me? Can't yeah. remember. Some syrup. Oh, gosh, it looks so good. Is it nice? I'm not sure you can handle that, actually, thinking about it. Oh, that's such a cute throwback. I'm a big fan of that. Um... Go on, tell me how your week was then. How's everything on the ward looking? Um, can I, can I make a special request? No work talk, got it. No, 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 it's a, it's a really special request. Where's this going? I really liked the, um, the game date the other night. I, oh, so did I, I thought it was wicked. So could we do another one tonight? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just such a big gamer. Are you gonna... <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it's fine, fine. You're laughing. No, fine. no, 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 I'm not laughing. I'm laughing because I'm game. I'm game. You see, see, did you see what I did there? You see. Well, go on, tell me. Go, go. What did you have in mind? <laughs> okay, cool. All right, so have you got a pen and paper to hand? Yes. They're, they're the only two things we're going to need. Yeah. Uh, boom, boom. Food out of the way. You've really planned this, haven't you? You've. No, obviously. Um, so we could either have a draw off yeah. where we have to draw each other. Okay, I guess what a draw off meant, but carry on. Well, that's a good start. Well done. <laughs> or we could, um, <laughs> we could, the other option is a uh, game of consequences. Consequences. It's like a turn based game where you write a story together by thinking up different elements. Okay, I'm not sure what I fancy more, though. Well, uh, Quentin sounds a bit more interesting than just a can you simple draw. Be good with your words. Okay, do you know what? Show me what consequences is all about. How are we going to do this? Okay, so we take it in turns to write a story element each. Then, then we'll recite what we came up with. Um, it's usually pretty funny. Okay, so I won't know what you write. And I won't know what you write. Chaos, I'm ready. So do you want to go first or second? As in I write the first detail or the uh, second story detail? We'll let ladies go first. Yeah. Which you'll tell me. Very well listed. <laughs> I'll go for second. Is second, that's Ooh. good, yeah? Yeah, yeah, they're both great. Okay, all right, cool, second. Okay, so the first detail I need to write is a woman's name. Okay, right. cool. Your first detail is a man's name. Any man's name, or somebody I know specifically. Can't be sure. Like I've met. So, no, any man's name, you don't have to have met them. You could, maybe you want to meet them. It could be someone random. Done. Right, okay, um, my next detail is uh, where they met. Okay, you need to decide uh, what purpose they met for. Mm, could really change the whole narrative here. Uh, yeah, I know, that. this is where it starts to go a bit skew if This is good. Um, yes, got it. Right. What's your next one? What he wore. Okay. Right, you'll enjoy this one. What she wore? Bingo, got it. Uh, nice, okay. We'll put the yeah, number on top. <laughs> yeah, I got mine. Got mine. Got mine. I write what he what he said to her. So I write that. Uh, there, what she said to him. Okay. It's also good if they don't match up, isn't it? Like when you get these answers, they're just that. completely <laughs> random. Yeah. Or, or, or we could make a sweet story, you know, that's an option. Okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. I got mine. 
And my final decision is I get the consequence. You get the consequence. You write the, the final. You chose okay. to go second, so, so I get the consequence. Okay, okay, fair enough. Okay, fair enough. Okay, yeah. and, and so my final detail is... What the world said. What the world said. Okay. What the world said yeah, about them. the same. Okay. Okay. See all this plans out. Plays out. I think I got my things. So I'll read mine out because I'm first and then I'll prompt you for yours. So hopefully this works. We'll go back and forth. Yes, ma'am. Very funny. Right. So one day Shana met up with... <sighs> Vinny! They met in a dark alley too. Oh my goodness, Ooh. you dirty what? <laughs> they met in a dark alley to celebrate the end of lockdown. <laughs> he wore an orange jumpsuit. She wore. Uh, oh wow, a nun's habit. He said, I get stage fright in these situations. Poor, poor thing, poor thing. This is, this is getting dark. <laughs> she said... Five inches, is that it? Vinny, oh obviously you wrote that. Yeah. Then Shana's parents walked in. Oh my gosh. And the world said... Things will never be the same. <laughs> That's the end. That was good. That was thank fun. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for participating. Um, you're getting good at this whole digital dating thing. Mm, thank you. Good going for someone who's never actually had a proper boyfriend. Wait, what? Don't sound too surprised. After the shit you put me through about my past relationships on our first date. Remember, we, didn't we didn't want two inexperienced dates, idiots banding together, did we? Okay, then why the lack of boyfriend? Are we We've, talking too high been. standards, circumstances? What is it? A bit of both, if I'm honest. I need someone I can depend on, and I need someone who is able to depend on me. Okay, what else? Someone nurturing and down to earth, and yeah, I'd like to be physically attracted to them, but that's actually not the be all and end all. So it was high standards? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Go on then, your turn. So tell me about your perfect partner. Ooh, I don't know where to begin. Um... Oh, should we build it together? Okay then, okay. Yeah. Okay, so, okay, right. Um, What's more important, appearance or intelligence? Okay, you can have both, you know. That was not the question, oh, didn't okay. it? I said pick one. Fine, okay. If I had to pick one. Um, okay, I think we're going to, I think you're going to agree with this. That attraction fades very quickly if you can't have an intelligent conversation with someone. Amen to that. Okay, so we're on the same page with this, yeah? Okay, good. Same page. Nice. Okay, so how about how about success or principles? Okay, you can definitely have both with this question. I surely don't have to. That is not the principles. rules. That is not the rules. <laughs> Strong values make for a content life, regardless of material success. Wow, that was like music to my ears. Yeah. That is absolutely what I wanted to hear. I did not expect you to say that. Okay, good, good, good. Right, last one. Confidence or humour? This is a good question. Confidence or humour? Mm. Trying to think maybe what, yeah. What, uh, don't think too hard. Vinny, you had Confident as well. That's a trick question because humour is confidence, sex appeal, and everything else just rolled into one. Right. Okay, you got me there. Do you agree? You actually got me there, and I hate to say that I agree with you. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I'm still letting you know that people with all six do exist. Yes, really but well. they are unicorns. <laughs> that is why there's lots of singletons knocking around. Okay, yeah, uh, not everyone can be a unicorn. <laughs> exactly. And we'd all be actually very lucky to find one compatible person to settle into married life with. So that one person whose strengths uh, like balance out our flaws. Oh, it's not the first time I've heard you mention marriage. Is it not obvious from the beginning that I'm looking for someone who is very serious about it. Mm, I, I think I possibly missed that. It's just that where I'm at in life, I uh, I need to be sure that the next relationship that I go into has marriage as a very, very possible outcome. Mm. Where's your head out on the N word? Marriage. Marriage. Uh, You're the first serious. person to ask me about that in a long time. Not that she's proposed, but just where I'm at that life. point too. 
yeah, I feel like I know my wants and my needs, and hopefully the next person I get with will be my last. So, I was wondering, Vinny, if you'd like to move off this app, because I just think it'd be really nice if we could text and stuff. Callum checking in. Hi. Hey, hey, why are you whispering? Um, Took it to the next level. Because my parents are light sleepers and they would not be happy with me being up so late talking to a boy, that's why. Okay, so I guess I'll have to charm them sooner rather than later, yeah? I was going to say my mum's a tough cookie, but I wonder if she'd like you. Do you know what? I think. I actually think I'm pretty good with parents. I think mums tend to really love me. What about dads? Because my dad, are, yeah, my dad's a tough cookie. No, no. See, this is where people think, this is where they get wrong because you, what you have to do is you have to sit with dads and let them tell you things about their past. You know what I mean? So I just sit and just listen and they'll tell me stories. And I think dads are not really like it. See, that's the third day complete. Them two has gone great. Um, like I said, there is ten possible outcomes. Uh, they've captured over seven hours of FMV footage to go through. And then you get the choice of five single women at the time. So you can have to pick the first three. Um, you pick any combination of the five. And you now it down. So every time you add a day, you put it down to the next two and then down to one. You can decline at any time. Let's say it's out now on the Xbox Store, $8.99. It's currently on offer. I think the regular price is $9.99. I'm not too sure. It won't be much dearer if it is. Um, if you like games by Wales Interactive, pick it up. They do games like Dead Shift, uh, New Adventures, Bandits, and Dr. Decker. Uh, don't knock it twice, that sort of thing. It's all interactive games as well, so it's not too much input you need to do. It's more like um, talking, interactions. So you just, just take it story and just enjoy it. This one here, it's very relevant to what we're all going through now with lockdown and the COVID-19 pandemic. Enjoyable, yep, definitely. Pick it up, like I said. If you do, let us know on Twitter at XBM underscore network. Thank you so much for tuning in and checking it out. Sticking to the end. This has 90 minutes to complete all three dates. Oh, we've had the three, we've had three at the beginning. Two of them once, so six dates really we've had. So it takes about 90 minutes. Um, time really as your cast of characters coming up you might recognize some of these names i think one of them has actually been in doctor who um yeah this stuff is going up on, on youtube so you can re-watch it as well again thanks for watching and we'll see you next time